Do you offer a recurring service and you are manually creating new Stripe subscription for new clients? On this video, I'm going to show you how you can automate the entire process of creating a new Stripe subscription using Make.com. Let's go. So I'm just starting a brand new Make scenario to show you how you can create a Stripe subscription. Of course, that uh, the trigger of the scenario can be anything, right? It can be when a new lead becomes a client on your CRM, for example, or when a new form is submitted so you can get the information from the client and you can create the subscription here. But for this example, I'm just going to go straight to the Stripe module so I can show you how you can create it. Because as you can see here, if you go to Stripe, there is no option to create a subscription directly here on make.com. So there is no module here for a Stripe subscription. Okay, so we're gonna have to, like in order to create all the steps that, that you need, you're gonna have to use make an API call, okay? But before that, the first step when creating a new Stripe subscription is to create a new customer. And to create a customer, you do have this option here on make. So you can click create a customer, um, is already connected to my Stripe account. And then when creating a customer, then you can add email. So let's add email, name. And of course you can add more information about that, that customer here, like address, phone number, etc. right? So again, just for this example, I'm just gonna connect. I'm just adding email and name. Okay, the next step for your Stripe subscription is to create a product. Okay, to create a product, you have to make an API call. Here, you just need to add the path for this API endpoint and the path is v1 slash products. Okay, and okay, as we're creating a product, this is a post API call. Okay, and to create the product, for the API, uh, for this API endpoint, you're gonna need to add the name of your product. So let's add here the, the name and the value is, let's call it product one. Okay, that's, that's it for the product, okay? The next step now is to create a price, okay? So Stripe divided in, in like product and price. So you should create both of them before creating the subscription. Okay, so again, for the price, you're gonna have to make another API call. And for this is if you want prices, again, this is a post. And now you're gonna need to add the different query string here to in order to make this API call. Okay, so the first one that you need to pass is the currency. So let's say it's USD. You're gonna need to add another one, which is the product, right? So this is the product that you just created on the previous tab. So, and of course, to map correctly, you just need to run this uh, once, okay? Because then you're gonna get the body here and you're gonna use the product ID, this one, as the product, okay? Next one is unit amount. So um, that's the, actually the price for your product. So let's say that this is gonna be this amount. And then the last one that you should add here to this API call is the recurring. I need to add like this interval. So um, again, we are creating a monthly subscription. So that's why the frequency that we are adding here is a month. You can create a weekly subscription, a quarterly sub subscription, so on and so forth, okay? Same thing you did here, just run this module. Let me get the ID here from the product to run the price one. Okay, so now it ran, it created a price here, as you can see the price ID. The next step, is to make another API call, but this time is to actually create the subscription. So the path is again, V1 subscriptions, again, a post, and then you start to add the query string here. The first one is the customer, and you're gonna get this from the first module when you are creating the customer. The second one is the items. So you're gonna add the items, and you are actually adding the price that you just created because you create the product, you create the price, the price is connected to the product, and now you're adding the price here to this API call. So price, and now of course you map to the price ID from the price that you just created, okay? The other step is collection method, okay? So for this example, we are just gonna use the send invoice collection method, but you can also 
charge your customer automatically. But as this is a new customer, you probably don't have the customer payment information. So you need to just send the invoice to the customer. Okay. And then as this is a send invoice collection method, then you need to pass days until due. So when this invoice is due and just add three, approximately just three days. So you're sending the invoice, we're creating the invoice and sending it over. And this is just three days until it's, it's due. Okay. And that's it. Now you have your Stripe subscription ready. So again, just to recap, first create a customer. Of course, you can also create the subscription without creating a new customer. You can just retrieve, you can just find an existing customer using, for example, the email. Okay. So you create a new customer, you create the product first, then you create the price, which is connected to the product. And then you create the subscription, which is connected to the price that you just created. And also informing the payment method, the collection method that you, you want to use for this subscription. And that's it. This is all you need to create your Stripe subscription. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope that by now you are able to create your Stripe subscription automatically using make.com. If you have any questions and if you want to check other processes, if you need help to automate this process or any other manual process that you have on your business today, just click on the link down below so we can get on a call and we can show you how AI and automation can help you skill your company. Thank you.